Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Xenovision. Today we're going to fix a very annoying issue with the Rage plugin hook on Grand Theft Auto LSP DFR where it's on the infinite loading screen. I just updated my LSP DFR and I can't get into the game. So we're going to fix this under 5 minutes so stay tuned. Before we get started I just want to inform you this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. If you find any value in this video please smash the like button and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to get out of my infinite loading screen. So let's do that. So we're out of the Grand Theft Auto screen and what we're going to do now is we're going to go to our uh, Grand Theft Auto main directory folder and that will be uh, anywhere where you've saved the full game directory. With me it's on the F disks and the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to update in our main Grand Theft Auto directory folder and you'll here you'll have an update dot rpf and update to dot rpf we're going to select both files and we're going to just copy these two we're going to go back to the grand theft auto main directory folder and we're going to go to the mods folder and then we're going to hit on the update folder and we're just going to paste these two files here we're going to replace them and that's about it folks the next step we're going to do is we're going to open rage plugin hook and we're going to start up Grand Theft Auto and see if this fixed our issue. So this is a good moment for you guys to smash the like button and hit that subscribe button so you can follow my channel. Okay, I'm just gonna fast forward a bit so you don't have to wait this part. So we just arrived to the loading screen, so let's see how long that will take us. And Bob, that was pretty fast though. Damn, it seems faster than before. Just keep in mind, my uh, PC specs are a E9 tenth generation x 64 gigabyte ram an rtx 3090 and two terabyte of ssd it seems to work yeah buddy it is working okay folks thank you so much for watching and until next time goodbye